So guys, I want to talk about fire boom. So because most times, once you click on storage, you normally see your this a uh, grenade sign at, at your top right. So sometimes it's showing zero, but right now on mine it's showing two, right? So what does this mean? It means that whenever you make a swap on hot, you are going to get a fire boom. So the fire boom means that it's going to give you an additional life, like if you are playing game, so that you can claim on hot easily. Like instead of waiting for some hours, like 24 hours, 2 hours, depending on your time, with fire boom, it's up to speeding up the whole process. So right now, let me click on, you can see, you can see right here, I, I have two fire boom. And you can see right here, like boom, your storage. So I'm going to click on the boom, your storage. So now, this one is, um. let me click on the first one first, make a boom. So I'm going to click on it. So I really want to make a boom. Let the boom be loud. Boom, you can see it now. It's not enough for me to clean. So I have, I have a second boom. Let me make use of it. And if you notice, it normally reduces my, my R. So it was 22 R. Not too long ago, now it's 20 R. So it's not enough for me to stick claim. So let me just uh, swap one more time or bridge one more time. Uh, let me swap first. Let me see if that thing if that thing will work for normal swapping or you just have to be bridging. Let me swap to um, USDT. Let me swap. Um, let me just swap one year. Let me swap one year. So I'm doing this just to show you how to get the fire boom. I want to see if so swap. Okay, so I've made a swap. So they gave me one fire boom. So let me go back. Let me go back to use it fire boom because that swaps so you whenever you make a swap here you click on storage so i have one fire boom let me make use of it click on it then make a boom i want to see if it will be enough for me to claim boom i think you need one more so the more you make swap and depending on the amount you are swapping so your your, your boom goes higher depending on the amount you're swapping so let me make um, just one more swap. Let me use the bridge function. So let me see bridge 0 0.01. 0 0.01 to that's three dollar to base. I'm still bridging. So I just want to get another fire boom. So that's why I'm making that bridge. So I might likely swap that USDT back to to near. So let me do that claiming on base so it's going to be showing all this function so and when it's done when you are done um with the whole claiming on base you can see right here bridged done mm. and i think the minimum you can do before they give you that fire boom i think the minimum should be it should be five dollar right so let me swap back to near Okay, that one is USDC. I swapped it to USDT. Let me change this to USDT, then change this to near. So I want to be able to get um, 6.50. So should I give me one year? Nah. Let me, because of transaction fee, no. Because I need to get my one year back in return. Not yet. Nah. Am I guessing? Yes. So this is my near. So I need to get review. Swap. I need my near back. So let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Because we swapped that one that was $3. They didn't give us any fire boom. So let's see now that we're swapping more than above $5. Let's see if they're going to give us fire boom. So it means that if you are swapping below three dollar or below five dollar rather, there's no fire boom for you. But if you are swapping five dollar and above, definitely there's a fire boom. You can see right now. Use. I'm going to click on use. So fire boom. 
click boom your storage then click here then make it boom so i believe now they will now open this thing for me to claim uh-huh because you see that first line there now so you need to be able to get to that line initially it was 20, uh, 20 hours right now it's 18 hours so i can click on claim again so the more swap you are making here you are getting a boom to make you claim earlier so if you have enough funds you can just be doing your swapping your normal thing then you'll be claiming more and more all right so this is how to get a fire boom to so see you guys on my next video